the Hawks. Plummet. Kennedy. The proceeding. There's Jones. Oh, it's up. It's up. Griffiths takes and scores his first goal for Scotland. And what a time to get it, what a way to get it. 1 1. There was absolutely no doubt that he was the man that was going to take it. He placed the ball. The sun was in his eyes. To hear that Griffiths, having got the goal, goes again. It's Lee Griffiths. Two goals, two fabulous free kicks. Catch him if you can. Catch Scotland if you can. Well, I have to say, I've not seen a celebration in a football ground like this for a long, long, long time. Nummer 95 inmiddels. Kom op, El Amadi. Doe het, doe het, doe het. Laat die kuip ontploffen. De bal ligt links van het 16 meter. Daar is de vrije trap. Daar is hij. Ja! 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 Het is 1-0! We worden gek! We worden gek! So many penalties in his life. Has to score. And he blazes it over the crossbar. It's playoff success at last for Huddersfield Town. Wins his header, a shot on goal, oh what a goal! David Norris 
has equalised for Portsmouth in injury time. And the northern end of St Mary's explodes in blue colour. It's an Easter cracker from David Norris. And they've pulled it out of the fire here, Portsmouth. And the bench are on the pitch. And the supporters have exploded with delight. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Shoot! Will it fall to one of them? It just might be Colton Cole. Vaste! Ricardo Vaste might just have fired West Ham back to the Premier League. Well, they might do. They are playing against a team that scored an abundance of goals in the last three, four minutes of games in Blackpool, but it would have to be the biggest of them all. Up by Blint for Laney. Decides to get it down. Lingard queuing up in the middle Martial and it hits Fellaini and flies in for number two and Manchester United are getting ever closer to a Wembley semi-final against Everton <laughs> 